Good afternoon from London and hello from me, Dr Dermot Hudson, the Chairman of the British Group for the Study of the Duke Idea, Chairman of the Korean French Association of the UK and Official Delegate of the KFA for the UK and President of the Association for the Study of Sangam Politics. And firstly... Happy DPRK Foundation Day to everyone watching and, uh, you know, greetings on the occasion of the 73rd anniversary of the foundation of the Democratic People's Republic of Korea, the homeland of the Juche idea. And I'm going to say a few words about this very important anniversary. On the 9th of September 1948, 73 years ago, the Democratic People's Republic of Korea, a duce orientated socialist state, was born. Now in its eighth decade, the DPRK has proved to be a most durable socialist state. Some socialist countries did not last beyond their 40th anniversaries and the USSR was dissolved in December 1991, some 69 years ago after it had been founded in 1922. But the DPRK is celebrating with vigour its 73rd anniversary. The news from Pyongyang, which uh, I'm sure a lot of you would have seen on KCNA, is that a splendid parade of paramilitary forces and public security forces was held in Pyongyang at midnight in the presence of dear respected Marshal Kim Jong-un and the leadership of the Workers' Party of Korea. The parade uh, included military dogs for the first time, and also, uh, another first, the uh, DPRK Fire Brigade. The fact that the parade could be held at a time when many countries are being laid bare by COVID-19 is a testimony to the strength of Korean-style socialism based on the Juche idea. The foundation of the DPRK was the birth of a new state of Juche in the Far East, the DPRK was the first people's democracy in Asia, a new kind of people's power. With the foundation of the DPRK, the Korean people took power in their own hands. The DPRK inherited the proud traditions of the anti-Japanese revolutionary arms struggle, led by the great leader, President Kim Il-sung. Indeed, the anti-Japanese revolutionary arms struggle is the root of of the DPRK. The foundation of the DPRK was a powerful inspiration to the oppressed peoples of the world who were groaning under imperialist oppression in their struggle for independence and national liberation. It was also great inspiration to the international proletariat who were fighting for socialism. The DPRK, under the wise leadership of the great leader, Comrade Kim Il-sung, fully completed the tasks of the anti-imperialist, anti-feudal democratic revolution in a short space of time and switched over to the socialist revolution, proving the validity of the duce orientated theory on continuous revolution. The DPRK is not a replica of another country it is not a puppet of anyone and it pursues totally independent duce based policies it is based on the principles of independence self-sufficiency and self-defense as great general lissom or kim jong il said our republic is an independent socialist state that absolutely maintains its duce character and thoroughly preserves its national identity in its development and activities. The Duce character and national identity are the independence and lifeline of a country. A nation 
and the masses of people. The struggle of the masses for independence is waged with the country and nation as a unit. So the party, the government and the masses of each country should conduct the revolution and construction independently and creatively as masters. End of quotation. Indeed, the DPRK is known by friend and foe as the most independent state in the world. Under the wise leadership of President Kim Il-sung, the DPRK created a people-centred socialist system in which there was no exploitation and oppression. The improvement of people's living standards, the supreme principle of state activity, and this is underpinned by legislation. The other day I spoke to a family member living in another country. That country was celebrating its Independence Day, so I wished uh, them a happy Independence Day. The reply came, there is nothing to celebrate here, prices are going up all the time. However, in people's career they have plenty to celebrate, such as uh, free medical care and uh, free education, virtually free housing and virtually free food. The DPRK abolished taxation in 1974. In Britain prices are rising and the government is going to rob workers by putting up taxation and national insurance contributions. In people's career care for elderly people is free and there are no rising taxes. The DPRK is indeed the people's paradise. As the great leader, President Kim Il-sung said, Our people are now enjoying fully independent and creative lives in the embrace of the Republic as masters of the state and society. In our country, all the people exercise their rights to independence through active participation in the political life of the state. They are adding lustre to their worthwhile lives through their creative struggle to achieve the high aims set by the party, helping and leading each other forward closely, united on the basis of revolutionary constancy and comradeship. All the material and cultural needs such as food, clothing and housing are met by the state, which also provides them with secure jobs according to their abilities. They are leading equally happy lives, receiving benefits of free education, free medical care and so on from the state and society. End of quotation. Today, People's Korea is one of the few countries in the world free from COVID-19 thanks to the wise policies of the DPRK government and Workers' Party of Korea headed by respected Marshal Kim Jong-un. Today, the DPRK is marching ahead, holding high the banner of Juche, the banner of self-reliance, bravely defying the unjust sanctions of the US-led imperialist hostile forces. Long live people's career, long live Juche, long live respected Marshal Kim Jong-un. Uh, thank you, uh, for listening uh we uh, have uh some activities coming up and we're hoping to uh, hold a meeting in the west of england at the end of september and possibly another real life event in london in october uh, providing there is not a lockdown uh so always check out the uh, Twitter and Facebook pages, uh, you know, those of the uh, KFA UK and the Duke Idea Study Group of England. If you're not already a subscriber to this channel, Sungham 007, please subscribe and also to our affiliated channel, Korean Friendship Association UK. Uh, now, I haven't got a Patreon or, or anything like that uh, but uh, you know if you'd like uh, to uh, you know buy one of uh, my books or a book from uh, KFA UK and the British group for the study of the future idea there will be a link in the description 
of uh, this video. It's also a good way uh, to uh, smash through the wall of lies about the DPRK and learn the truth. Anyway, uh, once again, happy DPRK Foundation Day and uh, stay safe and have a great day and see all of you next time. Goodbye.